Hello, every pony uh, Sparrow Link fan here, and welcome, and welcome back to another, to the second part of Let's Watch of Princess Trixie Sparkle Episode Four. Um, in the beginning, um, Fluttershy got scared, and she got nervous of talking to the animals because she's, she's still in Applejack's body, and uh, Applejack is cheering, cheering Fluttershy up. So, let's continue on. Well, I hate to let down my friends, but didn't you see them? There were three of them, and they were so fierce and angry. I can't confront them. I just can't. Are you certain Twilight could not be of use? I don't think the forest could take much more of use. I still think she shouldn't have been bothered. Besides, Twilight's not the one who can stop these creatures of ease. Fluttershy's talent with animals has gotten us out of plenty of scrapes before, including a full-blown adult dragon. These ones in the forest seem like they're a mite smaller and younger than the one we faced. But you're forgetting that there's three of them! You saw how stressed Twilight was last night. Don't you think we could lend her a hoof on this one? You are the best dragon tamer in Equestria Street Fluttershy. Won't you come down here and join us? Oh, okay. Don't worry, I got you. I might know a spell that is easy to rule, but I need some leaves from a flower of blue. If some pony could help me seek out what I need, I could create a potion that would help us succeed. Flourisha, do you think you could help Zakora with her spell while I go talk to the others? I'll send them out with us. We can catch up with them later when this dragon problem is under control. I guess so. How about we meet back here in half an hour? That should be plenty of time to get the ingredients I need. Fluttershy and I will work with great speed. Why did it have to be dragons? Oh, poor Fluttershy. Be careful with that. That's very delicate. Fluttershy is still afraid of dragons, guys. She really is. Applejack, there you are. Have you seen Fluttershy? Yeah, Twilight. About that, there's an issue at Sweet Apple Acres that I need to tend to before I can go to Canterlot. Seems like there's a pest threat in our apples. I've asked Fluttershy to help me out. Is it bear spray? Uh, do I need to go find my tuba? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a few wooden critters from the extra force. I love the way she said that. <laughs> we'll catch the next train to Canterlot. Are you sure we shouldn't stay in health? I'm sure Fluttershy and I can handle it. Y'all go on ahead. We'll get things sorted here and join you as soon as we can. Alright, if you say so. This is exactly how I feel, Twilight. I got worried too. See you soon, you hear? I hope I never have to lie to my friends again. It's for the best, Applejack. But still. Oh good, looks like y'all found the ingredients you needed? Indeed, these ingredients were not hard to find, but this spell can be difficult when ingredients are combined. I require complete and total concentration, or this spell might end up in great devastation. Say no more, Zakora. We'll leave you to it. You know, Fluttershy, I've been thinking. If this here potion of Zakora's doesn't work, perhaps there's something else that we could try. What's that? That remarkable stare of yours. What? But how do I even know if that stare works? I'm in your body. I'm only used to mine. I could give it a try, but I don't know how in the hate to do it, to be honest. It's not something that I can exactly explain. It just happens. I really don't think it'll work. Well, then why don't we test it out? How? Maybe one of your critters would help us? One of my critters? Oh, I, I couldn't possibly do that to them. I know it might be tough, but I don't see another option. Maybe we can get one or more of them to volunteer? What do you say, then, little critters? Would you help us out? Oh, but are you sure? I really, really don't like doing this. Well, okay. If you say it's all right... I'll give it a shot. It worked, 
Bert. <laughs> that was mighty strange watching you make that look on my face. I don't know how you do, Fluttershy. <sighs> don't worry, Sugar Q. That's only a last resort. I'm sure Zakora will whip up something better. I hope so, too. Here we are, the product of my brew. This will surely help to see us through. What's this here potion gonna do for us, Zakora? This potion will dispel with resonating bloom, a thick green cloud of a precarious bloom. When the dragons inhale its strange earthly smell, they will be under a confusion spell. But what happens if we inhale it? I have a spell that will protect us from harm. It is not a potion, it is more of a charm. We wear it so we will be immune, but we must move with haste for it will wear off soon. Let's just hope it doesn't come to all that. I still think Fluttershy can talk some sense into these dragons. Alright, Fluttershy. The core and I will sit right here in case something goes wrong. You go do your thing. Oh, okay. Uh, Mr. Dragon. I don't think he can hear you, Sugar Cube. Mr. Dragon. Oh, she got scared. Hey, did y'all put your ruckus and fears out, you oversized lizards? Um. That's really good for our shine, really good. Man, Flarshy is really brave. Well, I don't reckon this is a coincidence. She's been 
messing with powerful magic, and I figure she's gonna want to stop a while after finding a counterspell. What better way to keep her busy than by sending a bunch of hormonally crazed dragons? Do you really think she's capable of doing something so mean? What do you call the spell we're under? An act of kindness? Well, maybe she got her hopes on the Alicorn Amulet again. I assure you that the Amulet is very much secure. Of this fact, I am certainly sure. No pony could find it without the princess's aid. Only Alicorn magic could find where it is laid. Well, regardless of how she did it, I think it's time we join the others at Canterlot. Now that these dragons are secure, maybe Twilight can shed some light on all this. I sure hope so. I don't want to face any more scary monsters. Are you all right to watch those critters now, and maybe keep an eye on those dragons? Of course, my friend, but you must make haste. There isn't a moment of time you should waste. I have a strange feeling, almost like a sixth sense, that something wrong has happened in your absence. Oh no! What? What happened? Of this fact, I do not know, but it is of utmost importance that you must go. Alright, I'm going to stop right here because I need to go to bed, so uh, thank you guys for enjoying my videos, make sure to subscribe, give the like, and make sure to leave the comment if you like one of my videos. Have a good night, guys.